Hello everyone, my name is Lily and welcome back to Ellen Wake. We are... In, uh, yep, cross the ghost town. We just finished crossing the ghost town in the last episode and I really hope that we never have to go back in there because that was quite an ordeal. I kind of forgot where I have to go though. Uh, I know that we're meeting the kidnapper. He wanted us to go someplace specific. Actually, let's see. The kidnapper never showed up for the meeting. Instead, he wants to meet Wake at the Mirror Peak observation platform. Okay, so that's where we gotta go. Is it... I... I'm not entirely sure where we are. This used to be a mining town. Switch something up. Good, good, good lord. Good lord. Good lord. I'm like, okay, I... Easy, 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 easy. Okay, second one. It's, it's, okay, it's, it's okay. Are we okay? I'm okay. I almost had a heart attack, but I'm okay. Holy shit. Okay, there, now we can do it. Oh. I don't, I, oh, I have to insert the battery because that thing is gonna wreck us up. Iron horse encounter a steam engine? Is that what that was? Holy shit. Okay. I'm alright. I was not expecting to come into this and immediately get my ass handed to me. Uh, what was that? This, this used to be a mining town and after an earthquake in the 1970s, it was entirely shut down. Because even though, like, several dozen people were killed in accidents and stuff like that, it, I mean, there wasn't, it wasn't enough death. It really was not enough death. Okay, I see something in there. That looks solid to me, but I'll have to get closer and see. Is this... okay? I needed a key for the door. Of course. Find the key! Uh... Please, no more bombardment. Like, oh! Okay, hold on. I'm gonna keep it there. Cause I kinda have a- okay, so this is completely blocked off. That's good. Oh! Very nice! So, I was gonna say I have a feeling that as soon as I pick up the key, some shenanigans is gonna go down. That's always how it happens. Wait, really? Okay. I'm gonna take that as a blessing. It's, might as well. Okay, easy. Hello? Oh, lovely. I wish that it's so bright in here, I wish that I could turn off my flashlight. It's, it's kind of a waste. But our batteries don't really seem to go down unless we focus the blast, so. Oh. Anything outside of riding is a struggle. I feel ill. I managed to make my way downstairs. There's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of muses and creators summoning fabulous things from a magic lake using his powers to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Zane believes it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness above, where some Lovecraftian presence lurks. I crawl back upstairs. I'll borrow these things from my story. They ring true. They fit. Is that borrowing or is that flat out plagiarizing, my dude? There's a very fine line sometimes between that kind of stuff. If you were inspired by Lovecraft, okay, I give that to you. But because you read this guy's books and you think, oh, yeah, 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 that happened to me. Like, that's, no, 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 I want the shotgun. Can I, s well, can I? No, I do want the pistol and I do want the shotgun. 
I guess I'm leaving that here. That really sucks that they they don't give you a, enough bars to have all of the guns. Well, too bad, because I I want this shotgun. Clearly, that's where we gotta go. I'm just gonna take a quick peek. I don't want to miss anything. It really sounds like the shadows are behind us. Oh god. I mean... I wasn't wrong. Okay, hold on. If I had looked at the base instead of actually looking at the tree fallen, would I have actually seen the monster? Because I think we have seen it. It looks like a giant-ass tornado. But now that he has mentioned... Uh, was it spirits, forces, or whatever, wearing the skin of humans and Lovecraftian themes and stuff like that, I'm kind of getting a better sense of what's going on here. So that's really cool. I mean, not cool for the people that live here, of course, because I could totally see this being inspired by Lovecraft. The kidnapper had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. It was telling me to hurry up. So he kind of did well. I'm not. I'm not going to fault him for being uh, not so literate. It's not his fault. He probably had a rough upbringing. So, uh, but him sending insults so inappropriate. He does not need to do that. We already know he hates our guts. Just kind of. Piling it on top doesn't doesn't paint you as someone who uh, is very confident in what they're doing. If he was confident, he would have said, get up here or she dies. And that's it. You don't need to pepper in flowery language to get your point across unless you weren't confident in yourself. And I think that's exactly what our dude has going on for him. Birds. Oh no! Oh god, okay. Easy. 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 We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, I know your game this time. I ain't afraid of y'all. Smelly little birds. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, no, we're fine. was really waiting for them because they yeah but there's two groups of them there they they let out a cry as they're about to come and nibble on your buns yeah oh i should i should have done that oh i could i could do a flare couldn't i no but they they move a bit quick so I have to just listen for the call and hope that I'm good enough. Oh. You're okay. I don't think they're smart enough to come down here. I was at the silver mine. I thought it was a coal mine, but I guess silver would make more sense because they did talk about veins being very uh, prosperous down here. Oh my god, you can see the carcinogens floating in the air. They look actually kind of cute. Little, little fluff balls. Don't really think I want to be in here for that long though. Hey, is it possible? Is that silver? Well, they kind of... They kind of look like lines, right? It'd be really cool if we could find some of the silver that was being mined. Just to take a look at it, you know? We don't have the equipment. Tunnel? Go to... Tunnels go to Cauldron Lake. All of them? Sets a little. Yeah, there is some, right? Excuse me, I'm doing... I'm doing something. I'm... Isn't that they called it spelunking? Or is that just with mountains? I, I don't know. But this looks so cool. If this is actual, like, silver that they have in the thing, then I think that's pretty sick. Tunnels go to Cauldron Lake. Who? So, where? What do you want? What do you want from me? 
That's like when you're upstairs and your mom is calling you and then you finally go downstairs and you're like, what? She's like, huh? <laughs> she doesn't even remember. Hold on, I just wanna take a look. Easy does it. It said all tunnels lead to Cauldron Lake, so is it possible that we could take any route and still get there? <gasps> Without warning, the headache stabbed at my brain. That's not good. You got any, um, Tylenol or something like that? I don't know what kind of heavy duty medicine you need for migraines. Probably not her, but oh, in the water. I'm losing it. I gotta get out of here. Uh, I don't think that I can go in there. Oh, Paige. Cool. It's been a, a it's been a hot minute. The hunters were big, thick-set men, confident and at home in the woods. They were feeling good, running on beer, ghost stories, and camaraderie late into the night. It did them no good, as they were taken by the dark presence, sucked deep into a darkness far worse than any ghost story they ever told or heard. Well, this makes me upset because this means that I thought that we had- oh, hold on. Stuck somewhere in an old, unstable mining complex, Wake must find the way out in order to reach the Mirror Peak lookout platform. I thought that we had seen all of the Taken. Clearly. There's more variants. <laughs> Calling them variants is kind of weird, but that's exactly what they are, right? We have the hunter now, which doesn't sound good. They sound huge. Uh, we got the the rangers. We got the sickle stabby dudes. I don't really know who those are supposed to be. Maybe like some delinquents. Can't be sure. But why would they be carrying scythes? That just doesn't make any sense to me. I see. Okay, so that was just to see the uh, the vision that we had and to get the page. Okay. So that thing was a lie then. Not all tunnels go to Cauldron Lake. Oh, the water though? The water could very well be water from Cauldron Lake. Okay, I'll give it that. It's a little... It's a little hard to question the lore when I don't know anything about it. I want to know what that noise is, so... Okay, since we got a quick introduction to a new type of bat- Oh no, this looks- This looks like a boss fight arena! There is a page there. Oh, that looks so nice. I like the effect of the flashlight on the paper. I am not too pleased about this though. Alright, let me take a quick... Can I actually... Yeah. Quick stock of what we have here. We have a place that we can run around, so maybe kiting somebody? Uh, I don't know if that's an exit, and I really cannot see too much farther in. Supplies are there. Alright, I really hope that I'm wrong. <coughs> Okay, well that's- that's very clearly where we have to go. So let's take care of what's over here first. Even behind the closed doors and curtains of his grimy room at the Majestic, the local motel, Nightingale could feel the locals' eyes on him, the unrelenting pressure of their judgment. He forced it out of his mind. For all he knew, they could all be under Wake's spell already. You do what you have to do to get the job done. He took comfort from the bottle in his hand. Please, he thought. Just let me get through this. Under what spell? We haven't- we've only been here for a few days, and a f those few days, we were- We've, like, actually lost because, uh, oh no. Wait. No! Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I love that I was standing right there. Oh 
Okay, easy. Oh god. I need to I need to drop. I need to. I died. I died. Yep. There was it was too much. There was really just Are you serious? They placed us all the way back here. What the actual heck? Okay. That was that was that was quite a lot, but I think I'm a little better prepared now that I know not to stand next to that door. Holy cow, I thought I was taking uh, refuge. Because I don't I don't know if the information has changed since I was in school. And I came from a place where uh, earthquakes... Am I going the right way? Yeah. Where earthquakes were quite common, and so they say, you know, there are certain rules, procedures that you have to do to prevent yourself from uh, getting injured or even death during an earthquake and I thought I was following the rules but clearly I was setting myself up for instantaneous death oh it, was, it wasn't instant but uh, it was not an ideal situation that's for sure uh, that's nothing right that's nothing okay so I'm just gonna grab all the stuff that we had grabbed before and I'm gonna be... We have... Okay, I think we only have two of these, but we have a lot of flares, so let me try and use the flares. Okay, and then I'll stay over here. Or not. I have to get closer, I guess. Yeah. Well, that sounds terrible. Standing right in the way of damage. Is that the hunter? Hello? Okay, take it easy. Who is this guy? No! Easy, easy. He has a charge attack. Okay, easy. We got. We got. Holy cow. Holy cow. I didn't realize that guy was gonna come charging at me. But we're alright. We we only used two flares. So that was good as well. Holy cow. We're alright. I'm- I'm so ready to get out of here. Oh my goodness. This place is quite claustrophobic. Oh! This at least makes my day a little bit better. I don't know if there's an achievement for getting any more than 25, but we'll just have to see. Uh... Okay. I suppose here. So why the heck not? I am thinking that the pages that I keep missing are pretty decently hidden. Because if I'm not finding them... I'd have them... to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. So if I'm not finding them, like, on the path, then I think it's it's pretty safe to say that they're decently hidden. Move elevator. Can I actually get on this now? Yeah, but question is how- oh. That answers my question. Is there any- I'll have to bring it back up, of course. This is cute. It's such a sweet, uh, puzzle. Oh my, are you shitting me? I'm gonna have to jump on that? I'm not too good at jumping. Wait, how do I? Okay, so if even if I'm on here, I need to get up there. Do I climb? That means I gotta adjust this a bit. Maybe like, that feels too high. 
I hope I don't remember if it checkpointed, but I hope that it did because I'm not feeling too confident in my choices here. So, yeah. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. I was gonna say at least I got saved, but I didn't. All right, let's try that again. I have to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. I really hope that I can. I don't like how it's kind of twisting and turning and twirling around as it goes up and down, because that makes things a little annoying. I, I I think that I can climb. I'm pretty sure that I can climb like small obstacles. So why was I unable to make the jump? I'm gonna I'm gonna pull it up a little bit more and see. It really, it really does go all the way around. The thing that sucks is when I'm on it. I, I'm pretty sure I got to jump onto it like that. Okay, let's test this. Oh, okay. I got you. I got what you were putting down. Wait. I just came from there. I just came with that, right? This is... This is different. This is different. This is different. Okay... Ladder? No ladder. Ladder there. I honestly thought that this was gonna be like a no-brainer now that I'm actually using my brain. It's like, oh man! Okay, hold on. Okay, so I need to go through here to there first. So I need to lower this just a smidge. Yeah, like, like so. I think that is probably good enough that I can jump onto it. I hope. I don't, I honestly don't know how, cause there's so many splinters here. There's so much rust. I would be screaming. Everything here just looks so unhygienic. And he just he doesn't care. Wait. There's... Oh, do I have to kick this ladder down? Yeah. Okay, and then I go back down and then I lift it up even higher. I gotcha. Cool. Cool beans. We got this. And then just go all the way up. Well, not- yeah, that's- that's probably good enough. And let me go back up the ladder. So even just touching this ladder, I would- I'd need gloves. I'd need like hardcore duty gloves for that stuff for me to feel safe. I don't know if it was the thing behind me or if it was the thing that I was standing on that was creaking, but I really have expected everything to just fall out from under my feet. Really thankful that all of those times where I've expected stuff to fall, it hasn't. Wow. That stuff was so old. Wait. Hold on. I, I just want to see if there's anything here, right? I'm pretty sure we gotta go up. No, you know what? Oh god, I've got the freaking birds. They coming, they coming, they coming. That's right. What is controlling the birds? Okay, so that's their scream, but I'm hiding in here. Hey! What? 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 Okay. I honestly don't know what happened. I'm just- I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. What is- what was happening? What is happening? Easy, easy, easy. Yeah, I told you, dude. We need to kick back up the cardio. Because if you are- Dying while running for your life. It's it's not gonna be of any help. Can I get inside this? 
What is this? This big scaffolding? I mean, there's a ladder. Maybe I actually have to go down, because I did see the uh, trolley thing. Oh, paper. Okay. It's worth it. Worth it for the paper. Let's see what it is. Lightning flashed behind the windows of Cauldron Lake Lodge. Tor Anderson laughed and held the steel hammer above his head. Nurse Sinclair was trying to calm him down without success. Tor grinned madly and shouted, My hammer's up. Here's a friendly poke from Mulnir, wench. He brought the hammer down with all his might on Sinclair's head. We're on a comeback tour, baby. Are these... Are these the old dudes? Please, please don't tell me that the old... One of them, because they were brothers, right? Please don't tell me that he just killed somebody. This is quite, quite nice, so... <laughs> That's like... It's like the Assassin's Creed thing before... This is... Was this before? No, I think Assassin's Creed came out in 2006, right? The very first one? I don't know. Maybe they got inspiration from that. Okay, I do think that I have to go down. Yeah, see, I see some shiny stuff down there as well. The trees... Oops, careful. The trees look so nice, even though they're pretty low poly. It, kind of, it feels like there are a lot of trees here. Which is kind of important, especially if you're lost in a forest. Anything there? No. All right. Okay. Okay, wait, I want to grab this stuff because I don't know if I'm ready. Oh, I see. I see. Okay, I am ready then. I'm very worried about the birds. Cause I don't know where they are. They just kind of disappeared. So we'll have to see. We went there, right? I'm pretty sure that's where we were originally. I do also appreciate they give so many checkpoints. Another cable car. Just great. Oh, I know. I'm also having traumatic flashbacks, dude. It's okay. Is it? Is it okay? Yeah, that's okay. As long as. As long as we don't get stuck out here. Cause I, I don't- if we got- if this thing stopped, no one is coming for us. No! No, 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 no! No, no, no! Are you shitting me right now? This is, I have to protect myself from these guys? This, this, oh god. Which one do I keep an eye on? Both of them are hovering at like an uncomfortable level. Oh no, I lost sight of the other ones. <gasps> Go. What? What? Where? Huh? Okay, easy. <laughs> focus so I don't I don't know where the camera was but it was not in my control oh god that is not what I wanted just thought that was right into that guy's ass there he goes I'm gonna call it baking or, well I guess cooking too right I'm gonna Wait, can you see it? I'm oh, too slow. Okay, well, that's cool. Wait, are these... There's no way that this is silver. All the way out here? I think I was... Good board. Shit. I know that was a timed thing in that it was supposed to happen, but shit like that happens in real life and that is horrifying to think about. I mean, I don't know how many times you could say like train cars come flying out of the air, but stuff has flown through the air and almost killed people. Oh my god. Is there achievement for this? I wish that I could have shot it on the first time. That would have been really cool, but... 
I'm, I'm just awful. Is that, that is smoke. What's going on here? Uh oh. Yeah, the fog is starting to move in. I don't want the rifle. This is, this is not good. I don't want the rifle. Okay, let's keep going. Oh no, okay. I, I, there. I don't, I, I think that it's a, li a little bit overkill. Let's get a little bit more distance. I like how he's running now. Oh no, he's slowing down again. There's a light, there's a light. There's a All right. Oh. What the hell is wrong with you? So they disappear completely if you're in the light? Do they come back? They don't come back. That is actually super, super nice. I think that if you're playing on a harder difficulty, that would be a really good strategy for, um, for keeping supplies. That's really nice. Can I read this? Yeah. Cauldron Lake, the eighth deepest lake in the world. Cauldron Lake is a caldera lake formed in a volcanic crater. The volcano itself could be considered to be active, but it has not erupted since the volcanic earthquakes of 1970. And even then, the underground activity was comparably mild. Despite some property damage, there were no casualties. I thought, oh, I guess in the eruption itself there were no casualties, but it affected the mines in the area, and that's where the casualties came in. Cauldron Lake is one of the most beautiful spots in the Bright Falls area, as well as a central figure in many local folktales. It's a popular recreational area for the area residents. That's so nice for them. It's a shame that we've come and borked it all up. Okay, take it easy, take it easy, because checkpoint reached and we don't know when those guys are going. No! Please, Alan, stop! I can't run. It's just making me walk on this bridge of doom. Uh, you don't need to do that. Wait, I'm sorry, who's that? Let me just get off of the bridge, and then you guys can be little shits. There's a thermostat over there, and I want it. There's another one on the bridge. Oh, it's the hunter. He's got a lot of stamina. He's got a- Ow! I, I just saw it, like, at the last second. Your turn is coming! Give me a break. These guys really want to be friends with my bullets. I'm not gonna uh, um, deprive them of it, but they need to have patience and wait their turn. Death is coming for them. They just need to wait a little bit longer. Okay, let's reload the gun because I know that can take a bit of time. Easy, I'm, I'm stuck on this rock. I like the caches though, even though I don't necessarily need them, I just like getting them. They make me feel a little bit safer. I could pick them up. I would like to- well, I guess it does make sense if they do leave a flare gun eventually, right? Not eventually, every so often. Because it's like, why would you just have a cache every time full of ammo for stuff and you don't actually provide the guns? I got you. Oh no. Oh, paper. I, I guess we have to go this way because the bridge is out. So that's, it's good that I saw it too. Uh, this one. Maude had checked all of Stucky's rental cabins. There had been no sign of the wakes. It was dark when he'd found their car parked at the end of the road by Cauldron Lake. It made no sense. They must have taken a wrong turn, but there was no sign of them. And the car had been there for hours already. Frustrated. Mott stood on the rotten ruin of the footbridge that had once led to Diver's Isle before it sank beneath the waves years ago. The boss wouldn't be happy. So I honestly thought that he was working for the lady in black. But, oh wait. Stuck somewhere? Oh no, this is old. Uh, 
Because I thought that he wanted the manuscript for the old lady, but clearly he's working for somebody else who wants the manuscript. Hmm, and we still don't really know who the old lady is, so it's, there's still a lot of questions. I suppose I have to go this way. Oh my goodness. Okay. At least it didn't splinter into a million pieces. Oh, too, too close. He has... Uh, no shits to give. Wait, are we here? This is such a cool house. Can we- oh, we can't go inside it though, of course, it's all bricked up. Wait, but there is something shiny- yep, there's stuff on the inside we definitely can go in. I mean, who's there to stop us? Right? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. I miss you, Tom? Tom, I miss you, Tom. I miss you, Tom. Did you write this? I curse you, Thomas Zane. That's the writer. Uh, C C W and T Z. Who do we know that is a C W? Oh wait, you talk to me on TV. So some this is actually. Oh, so cool. I'm horrified, but I'm also, like, taken in. I love it. It's the, the mystery of it all. Oh, wait. I really- I'm totally into that kind of stuff, and I think that if I wasn't so spooked, I would be so obsessed with games like the Mortuary Assistant and Phasmophobia. I just enjoy watching people play those games. I can't really handle the stress myself. But I love the lore and those kind of spooky games with our hidden messages and people are left behind. And uh, spirit-wise, I mean, and their bodies are gone, but they are still here hating, hating everybody. Oh lord! Okay, this calls for this. Defeat 50? That is not what I wanted, but it came out anyways. Come on, come on, come on. And I cannot see shit. There. I don't know what your game is. We good? That went so much better than I was expecting. I really thought that I was gonna suffer. But I'm, I'm getting the hang of it. As long as I have the grenades. As long as I have them shiny grenades, we're good. So let's do a, let's do a shit ton of damage. I guess I gotta get over there. I think. Not entirely sure. Right? Maybe? I mean, they wouldn't have this here if they didn't want me to go. <gasps> yeah, perfect. I wonder who lived here? That's such cool lore. It's like so isolated as well, and there was no... road to come up here, unless you consider this to be the road? I don't even think a car can take this kind of angle. You'd have to park down there and walk your way up. Seems way too dangerous. Oh. I, I feel I so could much. I see Cauldron Lake. I thought I could make out the spot where the island and the cabin had been. There was a light near it. It had to be a boat. Yeah. I feel at ease when I see the lights, but I that's such a false sense of ease, right? Because you know the I light is supposed to. Now. I had to get there fast. I dreaded what I would find. It's supposed to keep you safe, but it's been nothing but terror in this game, so. I tried to hold on to Alice. But her form melted away. I was losing control. Dr. Hartman stood in her place. I wanted to hit him, but my arms were jelly. 
He smiled. It was a reassuring smile, and I hated him for it. I had to give you a sedative. Don't fight it. You went through another rough period. Right now, it's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. Wait, really? Is... Is he... Is... Are all of... Okay. Words. We can use the words that are there. Is he currently a patient Wait. in... Are you? Wait. Hey, I'm here! I'm coming! Uh, no! Get away! Sorry! Please, lady! The boss didn't know who he was messing with! I didn't know! I swear I didn't know! Oh, we shit. We don't know where she is! She's probably around! We just said we had her make a play ball and see you see? Get away from us, please! Please! Oh. I'm sorry! Please don't hurt me! No, hurt him! I would appreciate it. So is he currently a patient at the clinic and this is just a bunch of lucid dreaming? I don't I don't know how I feel about that. Oh. Oh, or there he goes. It's the tornado. At least he was quick thinking. That looks so scary though. That looks so cool. What the heck? Oh, don't die here, dude. The old lady had her. Another episode is over. How cool. Dude, that was such a sick ending to that episode. I really wish that I could keep in the music, but I don't want to have any issues. That was so good. Episode, end of episode three. Holy Previously shit. on Alan Wake, I'm hunted by the law. Sheriff, Wake's running. I'm giving chase. Are you seriously telling me that writer just took out my deputies? A thriller I supposedly wrote is coming true. The genre of the story seems to be shifting. <laughs> It's turning into a horror story. I was told that Alice had been kidnapped, but that was a lie. We don't have his wife. We don't know where she is. Her purported kidnapper was eaten up by the dark presence before it attacked me. Episode four, the truth. <sighs> Alan, shh, baby. It was just a nightmare. Alice. I doubt there that. There you go, Alan. Hartman, I fell. I had to give you a sedative. Don't fight it. I... You went through another rough period. What? Right now, it's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. The shock of your wife's death triggered a mental illness. No, you're... You lie. You're suffering from various symptoms of undifferentiated schizophrenia. Oh, shit. Uh, it's okay, Alan. Just let go. Holy shit. I felt groggy. Whatever Hartman had bumped in me was making me numb. I felt like this was happening to someone else. Someone I was watching on television. I couldn't think. Couldn't focus. This is actually quite nice. Uh, for a hospital room. I don't really think this is a hospital room. There were only empty sheets of paper here. No manuscript pages. Okay, hold on. I am going to call this episode here for today before it gets any more intense because holy cow. Good no. evening, Alan. Are we feeling better now? Feeling calm? Yeah. I see you brought your pet gorilla with you. So sure, I'm calm. I get the message, loud and clear. 
Why, right. That's the spirit? You're being very brave, Alan. I understand you're confused. I would be more concerned if you weren't suspicious of me. I don't blame you for it. Big of you. Now, why don't you come with me? We'll reacquaint you with my clinic and go over everything you might have forgotten. Little walk and some fresh air? Yes, it will do you good. My first thought when his bodyguard walked away was I could punch him in the dick right now. <laughs> and his bodyguard would have to come back. I'm going to call this episode here for today. Thank you so much for joining me on this journey. If you liked it, please go ahead and hit the like button. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, throw those babies down below. And if you want to continue this journey with me, go ahead and hit subscribe so you get a notification on when the next episode is out. But until then, I'll see y'all later. Bye!